Hey guys, this is Laser Ray. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Ash Gray. It's Jacqueline back there, if you heard her. Um, so we're still. I didn't even move. Okay. We're in a Pokemon battle now. Um, we're still in Mount Moon. Or Mint Moon, or however you guys say it. I'm not really sure. But yeah, we're still there. And we're just riding down Pokemon, exploring everything, and we already fought Team Rocket. Um, like in the very beginning of our exploration, because I didn't think I had to go that way. Because the guy was like, oh, but just some people were over this way, but he lied. They're not over there. So I'm going to go ahead and give a, po a potion to Pikachu, because I don't want Pikachu to get into a really tough battle and then wind up... God, that eye, Pikachu. What's wrong with your eye when we get so close? I don't want Pikachu to faint when we get into a tough battle. So... Oh, yeah. It's not a creepy pasta game. Well, it'd be creepy. Well, I would, I would cry. Hello, little girl. Yes, it's very nice up here. It's nice of you to notice. Oh, what kind of fairy! Does it know a metronome? That'd be great. Nope, it just knows growl. I am going to save my Thundershocks. Okay, never mind. No, I'm not. I hate being. Ah, oh, you suck, a fairy! God dang, Encore! Ah, you missed. <laughs> okay. Pikachu doesn't let his infatuation get in the way of anything. Pikachu's a beast. I'm not mad. Of course you're not mad. You beat me up! Can you imagine like Ooh. Ooh, Can you imagine like escape Pokemon guys? No. Quick attack! <sighs> I like how the battles in this game are just so quick. It's playing diamond and it takes forever. Oh hey! Too bad don't come up here because it's not dark. Huh? It doesn't really get in the way. Well, then why are you pitching? I'm not. You like blind It doesn't bother me. I said it was really fast. Yeah, diamond's kinda slow. Wait! Okay. Pidgeotto. No! Butterfree! Butterfree gets to test out its gust on a bug, on a bug Pokemon. Hooray! It's super effective! Gonna beat up my own kind. I used to be one of you. But then I took an arrow to the knee. I'm probably gonna lose like five subscribers for that. Metapod, how did you even survive? I'm gonna tackle you down. Down and out. Yep, because you're a bug catcher, and bug catchers suck in this game. You won't find any cave Pokemon either. Well, I don't want to find any freaking cave Pokemon. I'm tired of cave Pokemon. I'm tired of caves. It's freaking sad, true. You know what? I'm done. 
just gonna be running for a while. Don't I have a repel? Watch that be a repel. Oh, revive! That's useful. I see a lot of Kaleri up there. Oh, hey! Me neither. Ooh, a ruined maniac. Ooh, he has a diglet. Diglet, 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 diglet. Oh, my poor Pikachu. Pikachu is dead. Pikachu is dead. Nobody, no electric Pokemon survives against freaking magnitude. No matter what the magnitude is. They just do not survive. I didn't know Diglett knew magnitude yet. No. I'm not gonna make it through this freaking mountain. Wow, good job, Pidgeotto. You dig it? That's not cool. Too bad I don't have time for your crap. Run in, run in, and run in, run in, and run in, run in, and run in, run in, run in, run in, and run in, run in, and run in, 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 I don't want to take the Moonstone, that'd be terrible. All the Clefairy would become angry with me. Just because I feel like pushing Paris around. Rephrase. Alright, Twerp. We're here for that Moonstone. Hand it over. I don't have it. They're using metronome, it caused a huge explosion. Okay, cool. You found the moonstone, the Clefairy must pray to it. Thank you for saving the Clefairy from Team Rocket. I've decided to live here with the Clefairy. You're crazy. It's been my life's dream to find the moonstone, and someday I'll travel to the stars with the Clefairies. Okay. The Kaferi sound like a Yoshi. Yoshi! What happens if I take it? Do I get to like fight them all down? That'd be cool. Okay, just cause I hate Paris. I have like a sudden disliking for Paris. Probably because it stun spored my freaking Butterfree that long time ago. Yes. Now I can stand here, ha. Huh? I guess they're not angry at me for it. I don't have time for your crap, Zubat! Yep, no problem. I kinda missed a little area in the back, but I'm not worried about it. I'm just ready to get out of here. Hooray! 
Now we gotta get to town because everybody is hurting. Cerulean City. Hooray! We're almost at Cerulean City. <laughs> Finally, dang. Roar! Is that a computer? Is there a computer just outside? What the heck? What lies yonder? I won't find out, but no, because. Okay, I gotta find out. It's bothering me. Oh, it's nothing but grass! <gasps> Eggheads! Let's fight the seconds. I love Eggheads. I think I used to have an Ekans in the original game. Ekans. I don't like how in Pokemon Stadium, instead of Ekans, it's Ekans. It's not Ekans, it's Ekans. The freaking announcer in Pokemon Stadium pronounces a bunch of the names really weird. Alright. Da heck? I think the mountain got a little bit messed up. Cerulean City! Hooray! That is cheap and un cheap. Who would pay one million dollars for a bike? No. Nobody can afford your prices. Nobody cares about bikes that much. Yeah, except for Misty. Maybe that's why she was so upset about her bike, because it was a million freaking dollars. Come here, kid! Oh, hey there. The checkpoint between Vermillion and closed off right now. It probably has something to do with blah blah blah. So apparently we can, like, not leave until we go on, like, with the story and everything. There are some interesting sights in the sea north of Cerulean. I hear that there may even be a gym up that way. Oh. The gym with a guy with the sand shrew. Yes, please. A poor Pikachu. I must be so upset. What? You look very suspicious to me, huh? I'm not Officer Jenny you met in Viridia, and I was my sister in law. If you met. My sister and I know you, you probably had some dealings with the police in Viridian. Now maybe you just stopped to ask her for directions. Or maybe you found a wallet in the street and turned it into her. Or maybe you're a burglar who broke out of jail. Huh? Oh, is that your trainer card? Well, that's evident enough for me. I'm sorry I was suspicious, but I really must find these burglars. The strange thing about it is that they didn't take any money, just a massive vacuum and a giant hose. But I really don't have the time. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, she had a really bad attitude in, um, in the show. I didn't really like that Officer Judy very much. No, uh, we'll see her again eventually. So I guess we have to go to the gym. Winning trainers. Bick. Jack. John. Bick. Uh, I wish I had named him Gary. Can I go in the water? That'd be nice. Aww. Can't run in here. Oh, hey there, ladies. Oh, you're looking for the gym trainer? You're looking at them. Where are the gym trainers here? 
We don't feel much like battling anymore. We just got beaten three times in a row by kids from this nowhere place called Pallet Town. We had practically rushed all of our Pokemon to the Pokemon Center. All we have left to battle is a gold deed, so like, there's no point in battling. I know what you want. Seal! Seal! Cascade Badge! This is what you want, right? You can have it. Just take it. A badge is a badge. Would you like to take the badge? No! Hold it right there! Alright, Daisy, if you don't want to battle him, I will. I'm a Cerulean City Trainer, too. I'm the fourth Sensational Sister. There are really three Sensational Sisters, and one Runt. So, little sister, it's a surprise to see you back so soon. That little girl- they all sound the same, they really do. The little girl with the big mouth who said she wouldn't come back until she was a great Pokemon trainer? Misty, you left here pretending you wouldn't become a Pokemon trainer because you couldn't compare with us, because you're obviously more talented. How beautiful that you are. Well, she is the only one- oh, Daisy, you don't sound like that. <laughs> well, she's the only one of us Pokemon can actually- Aladdin, get down! Good luck, little sister, you'll need it. Well, to be fair, Pikachu never battled in this game, in the in the show. So I'm about to lose this battle because. Okay, do, not. do not what? Huh? Pikachu doesn't want to battle Misty. It says that. <laughs> it seems to consider her a friend. Better take it out of the battle. Oh, you suck. I'm gonna lose. I'm just not gonna win this. Oh yeah, I'm not winning. I give up. This isn't gonna happen. God dang it. Why is everybody so hard? Yeah, you can't really encounter something that never happened. Holy crap. If you counter that. Okay, cool. Gust. Gust. At least I'm not losing. Okay. Gust. Letter free, you're the bomb. Starmie, no. Starmie knows recover, I think. Sleep powder! Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, little Starmie. My god. If it does recover, I'm in a lot of dang trouble. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do but just to keep gusting it. And apparently it's sleeping for so dang long. And it's gonna kill me. Quick attack! Sand attack! I'm gonna lose. Not afraid.
Don't kill by the please. Okay, thank you. Yes! Okay. I needed to buy more potions, but I didn't listen to this. Well, the shop is like, I can't get to the shop, so... Okay, still sleep. No, not the bag. I don't know how this is happening, but it's working. Come on, come on, come on. You got this, Butterfree. Oh god, it's woke up. Oh no, I used Tackle! Come on, come on, come on, Butterfree! Come on, Butterfree! We got this, Butterfree! All it has to do is stay asleep for two more turns! Come on, Butterfree! Oh my god! <laughs> A Butterfree won, with one HP left. A win. Okay. I'm just gonna take a little bit of a breather because Butterfree just... So, that was the closest battle I've ever had. <laughs> oh, okay. My Butterfree is the most beastly Pokemon of all the Pokemon in the game. Oh, I wanted to win. You wanted to win, but she got beasted by Butterfree. Thank God I didn't get rid of Sleep Powder by accident. Now if only I could bring back freaking Pikachu. Yay, Pikachu! Team Rocket, we just fought. Literally. Like, last episode. Well, I guess in every. Yeah, they're like in every episode, so. Your Butterfree is about to school you guys. My Butterfree is a beastly character. I'm glad that I uh, revived my Butterfree instead of trying to. Uh, Bring back my Pidgeotto or something. <sighs> this sleep powder is amazing. I'm never getting rid of it. It is like, help me, there are so many type spots. Yeah, I'm gonna switch out to Pikachu because I was training my- Oh, everybody's level 17! I was training my Pikachu originally. And Pikachu's about to be level 18. I dig poison gas. This is a tough poison. Alright. Pikachu gained 14 experience points. 414 experience points. My bad. Ray, level up. It's time that these make me want to go. <laughs> I don't like how they put that in the, ga in the um, game. It's time, it's time like these that make me want to go straight. We're all washed up, we'll never come clean. 680. They did a really good job with this game. Team Rocket's blasting off again. 
we never really got to finish our match. But now I want to. Now I know how strong I really am. I'm going to work even harder to become a great water Pokemon trainer. And she's gone. So I think I deserve a badge now. Seal, give me that badge. The underwater ballet was like a huge success, and now we can keep the gym running and continuing putting on performance as done for our adoring fans. Okay, well where am I getting this badge from? We're the world famous sensational sister. They found I already know this, chick! If you want to interview, you have to, like, call me. What the heck is wrong with you women? Do I get my badge or what? Did I get it? No? I think there was a problem and you might have not getting the Cascade badge, which is gonna suck. Okay. Well, are you gonna give me the Cascade badge, Daisy? Oh, their seal's gone, okay. That was quite a battle, you were- Oh my god. Thank god. We're giving this badge to you, and you and your Pokemon saved us all from Team Rocket, and you defeated Misty too. Take the badge, Zero, you deserve it. Heck yeah, I deserve it. Butterfree did an amazing performance. I'm 30 a day, and this includes even outsiders you got in trades. You can also have my favorite TM. She won what? Well, I just was in? Use an aquatic Pokemon. I don't remember if she won or not. She wouldn't have won if Pikachu fought, though. <sighs> yes, I know that. 27, I'm getting off now. Well, guys, that was like one of the best battles I've ever been in on a Pokemon. No joke. Alright. So thank you guys for watching, and I hope you enjoyed that as much as I do. We kind of went through a little bit of two episodes in the actual Pokemon series. Kind of well, finished up one, and then went through the second one. So you guys have a nice day. Thank you for watching. See you later.